Hey guys, what's up? It's Matt. We're back for one more with the Menace deck. I'll keep this on the draw. Ooh. Homesick today. Haven't been feeling good. Just kind of woke up from a nap, so I'm a little out of it. I apologize. Yeah, let's keep. Huh, okay. Alright, we hit our second land, that's pretty good. We can now cast everything in our hand. If he offers the trade here, I think I block. gonna end up trading for these eventually anyway so fine with that and play him her it Whatever. Irish Shaman. This time I will take. Fires, nice. Okay, so we will have it. Maybe we hit a mountain. Okay, tap them. Okay, we hit a mountain. Great. Play this guy, pass back. And again, I think I will block if attacked. Wow. He did not have a follow-up play. That's very suspicious. I don't know why he would trade then, because we have bigger dudes you could have just blocked. Well, maybe not profitably, because, you know, who knows how big an abbot can be. And well... Okay, tap my guys, that's fine. Don't actually have enough mana to sack these clues, so... So, like, maybe I'm not getting the storyline of this set, but, like, what do the clues find? Like, I mean, Nahiri was from Zendikar and came here. So does that mean that there's a rift between Innistrad and Zendikar and somehow Emrakul's going to come through the rift or whatever, or... Something else has poisoned the mind of Avison. I don't know. I don't get it. 
Okay, this is taking really long. What the hell? Okay, Uncaged Fury. Yeah, we can't really play that, even if we wanted to. Got kind of a commanding board here. Just a whole lot of damage ready to go. Let's see what he does here. If he plays something that can threaten a block or whatever. You know, the nice thing is playing a creature here, one, doesn't really stabilize him very well because A, it can't block this. B, um, if it's three toughness or less, then can't block another one. So he's going to be taking some damage here, no matter what. Okay, clue. Cracks the clue, which means he doesn't... Ooh, cracks two clues, which means he really doesn't have anything. Is he going to make a land drop here? He's five... Five non-land cards in hand and none of them relevant or castable. So either he's missing his second color or he's just got a bunch of big stuff. Either way, we're in good shape. Going to keep this in my hand. Going to keep my other two cards in my hand. Settle for just attacking with six and adding another threat. Seems good to me. This becoming a 3-2 menace that draws me potentially a card next turn is going to be pretty sweet. Aha, uh -huh. okay, so this is not mono white dorks, this is black white allies, okay, of some kind. Drana's Emissary, okay. It's a great draft card, that's for sure. It does not stabilize him very well here at all. And anything else? Or just that? Why are you playing so slow? Okay. Let's kill that. Yeah, I know I could done on my turn to get the prowess trigger, so that's probably wrong, but just used to playing in a way to be mana efficient. Plus I want to be able to cast whatever I can flip off of this Irish Shaman. Mountain. Okay. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Yep. Looks like it didn't much matter. Okay. Nice. Um, do we want to change anything? Yeah, it looks like dual shot will be pretty good here. And I guess I'll cut a fury and a expedite. I don't know. Just heard my cat throw up downstairs. Uh, thankless little fuckers. 
I don't know if anybody else has cats, but like, first of all, changing the litter is the worst job ever, right? Because you change it and they immediately shit right in it, and it's like, dude, fuck you. <laughs> And they, they're they're on top of you when you don't want them around. When you want to pet them, they run away. Um, they make fur on everything. You can't have black clothing anymore. Ugh. They just suck. Alright. I assume he takes Titan Strength here. Yeah. Okay. If we hit our second lamb, we'll be golden. Got a lot of threats here. All of our cards, except Titan Strength, have fire and lightning on them. So this is like a flavor fail here, this card. I mean, dude is jacked, but still. We're not about that. We're about running burn a nation. Lightning shit and swords and pokey things and devils. I mean, come on. My cat is now molesting my legs. I cannot stand this fucking cat. It's driving me crazy. Transgress. Is, I don't know why. I'm really shocked he kept that in against me. Game one, I don't think I even showed a three drop. Weird. Okay, we're gonna expedite to try to hit a land. We hit a land. We attack with our guy. Get renowned. Go away. Go away. Alright, well he's hitting his colors this time. That's fine. Hmm. I, I'm sorry guys about the long pause in between every single play. Maybe he has a bad connection or something. Okay. Hit the land. See, this is still great, because even though we didn't get to cast anything this turn, we dug one card deeper into our deck, which is exactly what you want to do. You just want to keep the th threats flowing and just keep opponent on the back foot the entire game. You know, and then next turn we can play Abbott, and we still have a mountain in hand. So if we hit a two, two mana spell, we can still cast it. Usually before I uh, start telling people to hurry the fuck up, I ask them if they have a bad connection because it's not entirely their fault. But. It's also possible that they're just, you know, double queuing or something and that I just think is rude. Okay. Hopefully we hit our dual shot <laughs> off of our next abbot, that would be sweet. Oh jeez. All the abbots. Hmm. 
Messenger. Okay. Yeah, we can play that. And since we have plenty of threats and our opponent only has two cards, I'm going to I'm going to attack here. Just want to keep the pressure up. We've got plenty of follow-up dudes to play here. Each one of these kind of represents two cards anyway. Yeah, I figured he would block this way, and if I had a pump spell, he'd be totally blown out here. So, not the greatest block for him, but hey, you know, it happened to work out in this situation. And we get those cutthroats off the table, so they can't really gain them life in the long term, which is great. Ooh. Drana, eh? That's going to be a bit harder to get through. Hmm, or not. Mountain. Okay. Attack, attack. Block the Abbot, I'm sure. Pump it, and basically we trade Titan Strength for Drana, which is great. Can't block this. Take in two no matter what. Go on to at least 16. If he doesn't block for some reason, we can just... No, no, we can't do that. We could just uh, face down the Irish Shaman. That would be pretty sweet use of our mana here. Menace. Learn to read. Reading is fundamental. Okay. Fine. I'm going to save these cards, I think. We will scry that to the bottom. And, yeah, we'll save those. we got plenty on the board to be scary enough for the second, for this moment. From this moment. Okay. Envoy. Doesn't do much here. I mean, threatens to trade with an abbot, I guess. Cutthroat, okay. But he's running out of cards. We just scried a land to the bottom, so not a land, okay. Fourth abbot. Come on, dual shot. That would be freaking disgusting. That would be Shkivos. Really, any any non-creature spell would be pretty great. Come on, Slowpoke. Okay, land. We did not really want to see a land there. Seeing as how he has one card in his hand, I think we just crash. Play out the Glory Chaser. And keep the Irish Shaman for next turn. Ok, 
can trade with these two abbots. It's fine. He'll gain four, take two. Or whatever. Oh, no. Alright. That's right. And play this. Ooh, I can even face down this guy. And now we've got a two turn clock on the board. <laughs> and he has one spread over four creatures, and he has one card in his hand and three mana. Gonna be pretty hard for him to deal with this here. Okay, another throat has been cut. Oh my god, I've been really not drawing particularly well, you have to admit. We flooded a bit here, but oh my god, all these card advantage guys are helping us get through it, but... Seriously, considering how deep we've gone through the deck, we're flooding out pretty hard. We have 13 lands left in our 40 card deck, so we're at like about 30% chance to draw land, so hopefully we don't hit any more lands. Sin, pro Sin Prodder would be phenomenal. Any of our pump spells or removal spells would be pretty decent still. Oh my god, what is this guy doing? God, put down, you know, pause Pornhub for a minute and finish your game. Seriously. I've used five minutes, and our opponent has used 23 minutes. Always watching. Uh, so you're dead? Okay, thanks for wasting my time. Appreciate it. Lots. Bye-bye.